Assalamu alaikum and good morning to all of my students and whoever is watching this video right now. I hope and pray that you're all in very good health, enjoying your lectures because teachers are working very, very, very hard to make the lectures uh, so much helpful for you, interactive for you. So you enjoy your lectures and you learn a lot, right? So we are in our uh, numeracy class, uh, sorry, uh, literacy class right now, and we are learning about alphabets, right? So uh, we are going to learn a little more about the next alphabet which we are doing, right? So uh, let's see what we are going to do today. So we have a couple of things which we are going to see, and um, let's see uh, what are these things, right? So uh, we are just going to have a look at them quickly so first of all i have a strawberry wow yes i have a strawberry so strawberry right okay so you're gonna put it here then i have a sunflower yay i have a beautiful sunflower sunflower strawberry sunflower yes so i'm going to tell you the names of the things right now this is sunflower you can okay right so then we have something like what is this seahorse yes if you have a seahorse see horse i'm going to put this over here see horse right so put the sea horse over here okay now we have i have like some of the things in my hands and you're going to tell me what are these what are these what do they look like they are seashells what are they yes the seashells I'm just going to put them over here so you can just see them. Okay. They are seashells. Yeah. They are seashells. And then I have something else in my hand. And what is this? Starfish. Yes. This is a starfish. So we're going to put this starfish over here. So we have seahorse. We have starfish, we have seashells, we have sunflower, we have strawberry, and we have number seven. Wow, number seven. Okay. And then we have, oh my God, something very dangerous, and that is Scorpio. What is it? Scorpio, yes. So we're going to put this Scorpio over here. Okay, let's put it over here. Right now, here I have a couple of things which you can see up on the board, and they say something different, right? So if I just hold the board over here, a little, a little. so you can put the strawberry properly. All right, but please don't fall down. Stay here nicely. Okay, thank you. So we have a couple of things over here. And tell me which is the starting sound of strawberry, sunflower, seven, seashells, starfish, seahorse, scorpio, and even snake. Yeah. So what is the sound here? Yeah. There are many things we just start starting, and the starting sound is yeah. The starting sound is so that means that we are going to do something that has the sound right. And what is that? Yay, that is the alphabet S, right? That is the alphabet S, no? 
right? Wow. S goes like this and like this and like this. Looks like a snake. Even snakes are sitting like this. They just drown themselves and they hide. Right? So today we're going to do the alphabet. Yay, that is great. So we're going to put our uh, over here. Oh God, just a minute. Just a minute, I have to adjust my board. Okay, no problem. So I'm going to put S over here. And I'm going to put the strawberry over here. Okay, can you see the strawberry? I hope that was going to stick because I don't how. Okay, now I have tried to adjust my strawberry as well and my alphabet as well, S, right? Yeah, like this. Okay, so you got to know that today's alphabet is S. S. The sound is S. Yes, sunflower, seven, strawberry, seashells, starfish, seahorse, Scorpio, right? Or scorpion, right? So we are going to practice a lot of tracing of S over here. So you're going to take out your alphabet fun book N to Z, right? Yes. Take out your alphabet fun book N to Z. And you will be uh, doing page number 20. Yeah. Come up onto the page number 20. Yeah. So what do you see on page number 20? Yeah, you see a star. The star is like this and the starfish is like this. Uh, so it has got like five corners. Stars have five corners and uh, the uh, starfish even, it has got five legs, the five corners over there, right? So we are going to do this. And this says the star shines in the dark. Yeah, we can see the star shining when it's dark. Uh, because in the daytime, the sunlight is so powerful that we cannot see the stars, we cannot even see the moon uh, because of the powerful sunlight which is coming towards our Earth, right? Okay, so we're going to do the tracing over here, right? So we'll be doing the tracing. This is a little stretched S. Ours is a little like squeezed right but no problem the formation is the same and it has got only one stroke because this is kind of the snake right so it starts from here you know that you're going to start from the red dot and you can do a yeah, curve there are two curves which you're going to join right a yeah, curve then well and then curve right curve then come down and then a little curve curve then come down and then a little curve okay that's great so right do the practice with your finger first do the tracing with your finger yeah like this very good that's good very nice very nice okay that's great so now you need to put the book flat on the table and hold up your pencils and you are going to trace the big S over here with the pencil, right? Yes. Please do that with the pencil. Okay. So you're going to take out your pencil and you're going to trace slowly, right? Start tracing the alphabet S. Good. Okay. Yes, that's very easy. Only one stroke, two curves you're going to join. Right, the two curves, which we are going to join them together, right? Yes, that's great. Okay, that's lovely. So is it easy? Yeah, that seems very easy because there's only one stroke and there's a line which has two curves. So we are just going to make that line. That's very easy. Okay, show me. Yeah, that's great. That's lovely, lovely, lovely. Okay, that's lovely. Now we are going to trace these now. Yeah. These lines, curvy lines. Yeah. 
that look like curvy lines. And they are very easy for you to do that, I know. So you just do the curvy lines quickly. Yay. Very good, very good. Do the curvy lines. Mm, very nice. Okay. Easy? Oh, that's great. So that seems easy to you. Only one stroke, alphabet, and curve lines. Right? That's good. So you've done it? Okay. Now, uh, look over here. They say that circle all the stars with the letter S. So we are just going to look for the letter S and we are going to circle all those stars which have num the alphabet S written inside, right? Now you're going to look at the picture carefully. Yeah, look at the picture carefully. And let's see that how many S do you find here, right? So I'll also check. Mm -hmm. Now you need to count. Look at the picture carefully and count how many S do you see on the star? Yay. Okay. Done? Now tell me, how do you, how many S do you see over here? How many? Four. That's good. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's lovely. One, two, three, and four. Now what are you going to do is you're going to circle the star. Yes, yes, with the alphabet S. Very good. Very good, very good, very good. Okay, that's lovely. So you have your star over here. You can even color your star, right? So stars bright. So they look all very bright, white, and a little yellow, sometimes a little reddish. Uh, but you know, this is up to you, whatever color you're going to do in the star. So you are going to color the star as well. So we did today strawberry and seashells and my beautiful, beautiful favorite sunflower and seahorse and starfish and Scorpio. Wow, this Scorpio is really, really, really horrible. So this is a Scorpio. So this was our alphabet for today and it is S and uh, we will be continuing till the end. Uh, but right now I'm going to say goodbye from this class and we'll see each other in the next class. Till then stay safe, be happy and enjoy yourself. And be grateful to whatever you have for uh, whatever you have but please subscribe to the channel yeah you have to subscribe and give it a thumbs up yes that's very good that's very good okay so see you soon inshallah bye bye and allah face